everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Reaction Therapy. I'm your resident psychotherapist, Tom Stevens, here to break down lyrics to some awesome music. And today we get to react to someone I've never reacted to before, but there's a close family tie. Jay Joseph is up. Gundabad's the name of the song. I literally realized not long ago that Jay is Tyler Joseph's brother and makes his own music. I checked him out. I looked up, just went to Spotify and checked the most viewed or listened to song he had. It's called Gundabad. So I'm going to react to this today because I want to hear up and coming artists, people who have great talent and great gifts to offer. So Jay, thanks for letting me react to this today. And I hope you like it because I know I will. Remember, our mission, our passion, spread mental health awareness to the world through music and lyrics. That's what Nick and I try to do every day. And we're thankful that you would be a part of Reaction Therapy with us to do that. As a mental health professional, I can't get enough of music and how it relates to our life. So if you want more content, go to our Patreon page, go to YouTube for memberships. It's all out there. You don't want to miss it. But shh, without further ado, it's time. Jay Joseph Gundabad. I'm a fan already. Like, this is what's great about listening to new music and new artists. I mean, what a message right away. Like, oh my goodness. I'm going to be myself. Like, this is, I don't know what Gundabad is. I actually don't know what Gundabad is. But um, it's not Gunda good. So it must be Gundabad. And I'm not going to be, I'm not going to change who I am. I'm going to be original. I'm going to be myself. If I'm pitiful, if I'm not worth it, if you don't think I matter, whatever. But wow, to die with syllables penciled in this thin three punch, this comes right out of his head, writing lyrics on paper and collecting that and just keeping it. I can't imagine how many lines artists write that they keep or they never use or they forget or they push away. But when the beat runs cold... And I do what I'm told. This is, to me, the epitome of all of it. Like, this would be it. When the beat runs cold, I want to tell teenagers this in my office. Don't lose your life. Like, stay on fire for something. When the beat runs cold and I do what I'm told, that's when I know I've grown too old. That's how I feel, Jay. <laughs> because I'm a guy at my age, and people look at me like, what are you doing on YouTube? What are you listening to, Tom? Like, you're old. You're not supposed to, I don't feel old. Like this beat has not grown cold, run cold. Oh, no, 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 oh, here we go. Um, I'm going back. I just might be pitiful, but won't live unoriginal. Yeah. I will die with syllables, pencil yeah, in yeah, this yeah, yeah. paper, save it for later. Read it back again, three months old. But when the beat runs cold and I do what I'm told, that's when I know that I've grown too old. You still tell myself that I would never be there. Yeah. When I close my eyes. From gun to bed. When you low broke chase, gun to bed's gotta be bad. <laughs> like behind enemy lines. It's like when you get behind enemy lines, not good. Not good. You don't want to be there. I don't think I want to be a gun to bed. So <laughs> stay away from it. Oh, let's, he's telling you, he's giving you the map to be able to know what to stay away from or go towards. <laughs> Just like a cigarette, but a cigarette, but, and just like a cigarette, but it's far less intimate. Mm. 
<laughs> this is good. Under the arms, just like a cigarette, but it's far less intimate. Those who lose their innocence as a privilege, the thrill of it. But you can find a better dope to fill in your pocket. Get an outlet, then cock it. Make them craft and yeah, people will knock it. Used to tell my This is it. You're going to get beat down for what you do, possibly, but you don't do it for that reason, like to get praise and fame. You do it because it helps you express who you are. I do therapy every day because it helps me heal. It helps me see people heal. It helps me witness healing. I'm refreshed every day, just like a music artist is writing lyrics or hearing good music. Like, it inspires me. And so you want to do something that lights you on fire and something you have passion about, but you're going to get beat down for it at times. You're going to get hate. You're going to get negative feedback, but you have to find something you love that you're passionate about and go out and do it. But wow, you can find a better dope to fill in your pocket. Get an outlet and cock it. I mean, uh, you do something, you're going to get hate, but you have to know you're doing it for a reason, not just doing it for the likes. Now let them cock it, make them craft it, yeah, people will knock it. Used to tell myself that I would never be there. When yep, I close yep. my eyes, my thoughts keep telling me lies. I expose myself for the sake of repair. Got the bad on my mind behind it. I'll be lies. This is great music. I am so thankful that I have seen this. I wish he toured like in Texas and came around. Maybe one day that could happen. He used to have with his brother, 21 Pilots, when uh, Jackie, my assistant, her son, went and saw them at the House of Blues here in Houston way back when it was just kind of growing. And here goes Jay. This is good music. <laughs> have got me down mm. but i'll just stick around sober in the morning cuts from falling down you hear that like highs have got me down <laughs> the highs and the down you get high whether it's using whether it's just mentally beating yourself up being in destructive or toxic relationships whatever it is you can make it what it is but sometimes the highs of doing things that, that you think are going to give you a high could be a relationship, could be a drug, could be money, so many things. Those can bring you down. It cuts from falling down sober in the morning. It's kind of like you sober up in the morning, like, what am I doing? Like, why did I do that? Or why am I with them? Or why am, do I keep doing the same thing over and over again? And then you deal with all the pain. It's all the, you know, destruction and damage from the stuff before but hey stay away from gundabad that's what he said so i want to know where gundabad is and what it is so i could stay away from it because i think it's about other people's opinions i think it's about my self-image being determined from somebody else and i think it's about toxic habits relationships or, or choices that i make in my life that are bringing me down cuts from falling down Put your feet down too high when you want to put your feet down too high when you want to put your feet down mm. drop drop yep, drop yep, you yep. can hear it from the seats now too high when you want to put your feet down yep. too high when you want to put your feet down yep. too high when you want to put your feet down yep. drop 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 you can hear it from the seats now yep, yep. too high when you want to put your feet down too high when you want to put your feet down too high when you want to put your feet down drop 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 you can hear it from the seats now Oh, that's such a concert song. I could so hear that in a concert. The crowd is just going crazy. This is a perfect song for that. Too high when you want to put your feet down. Drop, drop, drop. You can hear the feet down.
J. Joseph Gundabad. I am a happy man today, having listened to that. What a great song, a great message about yourself, your life, the choices you make, the situations you're in, the habits you get. Just where do you want to go? And you don't have to worry so much about the beatdown that comes from outside. You can look within and look, I always say it, getting good mental health treatment, getting good support groups, getting good friends, getting good social environments, getting good habits in your life, balanced living, right? Eating, sleeping, exercise, all that great stuff can help you live a happier life and put your feelings out like he's done in this song in some way so that it can leave your body and you don't have to be drug around all the time with it. But remember, this isn't real therapy, just Tom breaking down lyrics to music. If you want professional help, check the link in the description of this video. Leave us your comments, feedback, insight. Let us know what you think about Jay Joseph. Gun to bad, what is it? Please let me know. I want to talk to him about how he created this song one day. That would be awesome. And don't forget, if you want more content, go over to our Patreon page or YouTube. There's there's memberships. There's extra content, live streams, all kinds of great stuff. Go to our Discord server too. Over 2,700 people there. And please know we are grateful for you every day that you would be a part of Reaction Therapy with us. So we'll see you on the next Reaction Therapy. Reaction Therapy.